Go Design Team joining us once again. It's great to have you both back. Thank you. Thank you. We've been putting a, a call out to our viewers. We've asked for design dilemmas, mm -hmm. uh, specifically those involving window coverings. And we've got a great one here. This is Kathleen Jansen's photo. She sent us, and ladies, this is her design dilemma. It's uh, box windows, as you can see, or is it bow windows, are they that, called? Yeah, that's a bay. Bow yes. window. A bay. I, I don't know the difference between a bow window and a bay window. Are they the same thing? The bow curves a little bit more, and it usually has about five panels. Oh, okay, so she says the main room gets sunny and warm. Uh, she says it's south-facing. She's not sure what type of coverings to use on that window shape, so any advice would be appreciated. Well, the best blind would be this. It's a duet. It has the best R rating. It has a honeycomb shape, that so the air gets trapped in the middle, and it's going to give you the best on our value, plus it will keep the heat out in the summer and the cold out in the winter. So does our value mean that it'll keep heat in in the winter and allow it to breathe in the summer? Is that kind of how that works? This is the best. The only disadvantage is, is when you're in the hot sun and it's down, it you can't see anything. Right. So we do have one other option for Kathleen, and that would be the silhouette. And this will really help with your UV protection. So ah. when it's down, and in the open position, you have 88% UV protection, and you can still see out of it. And then when you close it, it's 99%. When you look at the blinds like this, I mean, does design drastically change over the years, or is this something you're investing in? You go, you know what? We might have these covering our windows for 20 years. You will, and when you're buying your house or when you're renovating, you have to put in a budget for window coverings because it's really important and people forget about it. It's really the jewelry to, to the home, and uh, with dressing up even just very simple blinds, which have got not a lot of color, you can really add some, add some uh, pizzazz by putting in some drapes, for example. Ah, over top the, over the, the top. blinds? So, yep. Yeah. And this one can give you a masculine or a feminine look, depending on which way you're going. So it just gives the warmth of the room. It really dresses it up as well. We certainly see trends, when, and you've shown many of them to us, uh, whether it's bamboo hardwood flooring or whether it's certain, uh, you know, uh, sort of hard angled modern types of furniture. But when it comes to window coverings, what's kind of leading the trends right now, whether it's material or color? The right roller there. shade. It's a, it's a sheer weave, which it, a, a lot of the time is PVC, but what it's nice is you can see out in the daytime, and yeah, so it, it really is nice, and it gives you a lot of UV protection. This one is uh, remote, <laughs> so you can be in your bathroom anywhere and open and close your windows. You can hardwire them. You can be in Europe and call home. There are thousands of people, myself included, that will buy something just because it has a remote control. You betcha. You're out of your garage and you can be flicking your switch and all your... Are you serious? Yeah, absolutely. Is that, I mean, that's one example of innovations and technology yeah. that we're seeing in blinds. You've talked about the improved R values of other blinds. What other innovation and technology are we seeing? Well, they hardwire them. Uh, so it's right within the home um, audio systems and everybody's hardwiring their homes now, right? Wow. And your blinds are no exception. User-friendly window you coverings. You betcha. There's just so many options to do and so many ways to then dress up because, you know, a roller shade, people don't think they're very attractive sometimes, but then you just add a little bit of bling with this. Well, yeah, I mean, you t look at this. You're almost accessorizing your window coverings you as betcha. well. Just the, those are the ends of the hanging yep, rods? Yeah, the finials. So yeah. that's where you can dress up your... Okay, your now you're the design expert, so I'm going to ask you this question <laughs> because I think these placed in the wrong setting could come across as gaudy or tacky. Yeah. So how do you balance it? How do you know if you can go with something that's really spectacular? Some of those look like they'd really catch some light. Yeah. You have to have bigger spaces to accommodate them or no? Not no, necessarily. No. I think it's working out the balance between what fabric you use, whether you're gonna use something blingy and whatever else is going on in the room. And obviously a designer can help you get that balance because obviously you've got to make sure that the rhythm flows throughout the space. Absolutely. It's very, very important. What else are you excited about? You've brought in so much today. We have about a minute left and I'd like to just cover some of the options that our viewers would be interested well, in? Well, you can just see this is a fantastic range of fabrics from Swatchbox, and you can do the whole thing in one, <laughs> on one strip. Look at your that. room, I mean, it's kind of outrageous, really, but yeah. you can have they some come cushions. Out of England, so, yeah. not everyone is carrying them, so it's not something that you're gonna, going to go to your neighbors and see this repeated. No. Because, yeah. I mean, if, if you're investing in something like this, you want it to be a little bit more unique, don't that's you? That's right. Yeah. All right, well, hey, we want to thank both of you, not only for uh, sharing some of your 
your expertise, but also for helping Kathleen out with her design mm -hmm. dilemma. And Kathleen, we know you're watching right now. We're happy to let you know that the team from Mojo Design is providing this prize pack, a beautiful box involving not only some home decor, but also advice to tell you on how you can improve your look. A $300 value consultation with Mojo Design and $500 to spend toward Hunter Douglas window coverings. Ladies, yep. thank you so much. And you can learn more about what Mojo Designs is doing by following the Inside BT link on our website. You know, my wife and I, when we got married, she moved into my condo and I'm very familiar with the <laughs> window coverings don't always fit every scenario discussion. <laughs> yeah, so funny. thank you, ladies. <laughs> Interveners when need be. Breakfast television back. A whole lot more after this, including Bridget Ryan, your news, traffic and weather and discussion on whether government should be involved in labor disputes. You'll find that on our Facebook page.